Welcome back to AJ's Fragrance Show, everybody. Welcome back to the channel, but yo, I got a straight banger for y'all, man. This was one of my very first reviews on our other channel, but this right here is 40 Knots by Zherzhov. Hands down, this is definitely up there with me when it comes to Zherzhov fragrances. And if you don't know by now, Zherzhov is my favorite fragrance brand at the moment, but this used to be my number one fragrance like ever, like my number, my favorite fragrance. Though it has moved down, even on the Zherzhov uh, charts, it has moved down for me. This definitely still packs a crazy punch, man. We got this around last year. I got this for my birthday last year. And this is certainly just an incredible fragrance, man. This is part of the Join the Club series from Zherzhov. This is, you know, somewhat like this smell resembles like the yacht clubs. Like if you're in a yacht club, you probably like really dig this smell. And then you have other ones like uh, Kind of Blue, which resembles the jazz club. And Kind of Blue is actually named after, I believe, Miles Davis's album. But this is, like I said, a part of the yacht clubs. And like, I feel like this is just a very, just unique fragrance, man. Packs a punch. Zherzhov has been doing their thing these last year, these last like 10 years, man. They have been giving us some of the most unique fragrances of all time. It's definitely up there for me, man. And 40 Knots, like from the samples I've smelled from the other uh, ones, a part of the Join the Clubs, 40 Knots is definitely up there for me as well, man. It's definitely up there. Like I said, it has moved down on my list, but I feel like this is still one of my favorite Zherzhov's and one of my favorite fragrances ever. I'd still probably rank it top 10, top 12, top 10. But yo, if I had to give this a rating, give me a 12 out of 10, man. This is certainly something that I feel like not anything can just emulate. Like the notes in here, very just like woodsy, salty. Like they just give you a very aromatic, uplifting smell. This smells very aquatic. Like I said, so somebody in the yacht club in real life will probably really dig this. You go fishing with this, like you can just like imagine any like Ariel the Little Mermaid would probably be rocking something like this. Of course, the Automizer, brilliant. Of course, Zherzhov. Man, Zherzhov don't slack at all when it comes to these fragrances, man. The Automizer, the look, like look at that blue. The prism, like the blue prisms in this is just incredible. Like, even though I've been savoring it, like, and I had it for some time, but I'm not trying to just like eradicate it because this is certainly still up there for me. Not something I just like to kill off. But yo, I feel like this, I feel like a woman could pull this off too. I do feel like it's unisex, but I feel like a dude will probably gravitate towards this specific fragrance just a tad bit more. This is going to gross you about the average price for uh, the Zherzhov bottle, which is 250 So that's probably what you're going to be spending on this. But on a lot of websites, you could probably get all tons of deals, man. Just go out and got to just shop around and look, man. Be on the hunt for sure. Don't give up on just 250 But show, I feel like... uh most people could pull this off if you was rocking this though man like i said this part to join the club so this is definitely a collector's item just in general man i don't have everyone in join the club but i do plan on copping all of them soon and when i do run out of this i'm going to re-up if this is a date night fragrance my friend asked me um for a guy, you could definitely pull this off, man. I wore this just casually, though. So, like, I went to the movies. I went out just to eat with it. You know, I wasn't rocking this on a date with my shorty. But I feel like if you do want to rock it with her, she definitely dig you for, uh, you know, rocking this as well. It's like, a, it's just not a very romantic uh, feel. You know what I'm saying? This is not super duper romantic. But it's certainly aquatic. It's definitely an uplifter. I feel like it brightens up the room. And I feel like it takes up a lot of space. So, you're probably going to be... Uh, uh, copping around, you know, three feet. You know what I'm saying? You're probably gonna be copping like three, free, uh, three feet, and this sticks around for about. I say you could definitely push for nine hours with this. I feel like you could definitely push for nine hours, uh, ten hours. You could probably push for actually, like, just depends on how much you spray yourself down. I feel like this is somewhat more of a spring or summer fragrance. And I feel like just lately, we've been really getting a lot of winter fragrances and like fall fragrances. I feel like a lot of fragrances are very spicy and they have warm notes in them. Like tobacco, the tobacco leaf is like really common in a lot of fragrances now. But I feel like this right here, you could probably rock in like the summertime or uh, springtime because you're on a yacht. You know what I'm saying? Like, I mean, Cali on a yacht. This is definitely something I'd rock to a beach. Most definitely rock on the beach, man. Build a sandcastle with your shorty with this. There you go. That could be a date. You feel me? Yeah, building sandcastles together. 
And this is just definitely something I really treasure, man. I'm definitely gonna re-up on this and you're probably gonna be spending about 250, like I said. Cool Zerzhoff appearance, of course, the curvy cap, they always snap with their appearances. And this is just something that I'd really just, you know, wanna keep around in my collection. This is still very much relevant, man. This dropped in 2000 and what, uh, 12, 2012, still very much relevant. Like, don't let the timestamp fool you, man. And it does have somewhat of a sweet nature to it, but yo, Everybody, let me know how y'all feel about this in the comment section below. Let me know if y'all rock with this. Let me know if you want to smell it. You know what I'm saying? Just any reviews you'd like me to uh, hop on, any recommendations or suggestions, let me know. I'll be sure to get back to y'all, man. Much love. This AJ Fragrance Show, we out.